I think there's a good chance it might. Unless I'm elected. If I'm elected, it won't. <laughs> what, what? Everybody knows that. Oh, okay. Everybody knows well, uh, do you think that the, uh, the big interests, uh, the interest group, are, are working to, to stop oh, you? Sure, of course they are. I mean, I don't get money from developers. I don't accept money from developers. The other other candidates do. The other, Mr. O'Brien and Mr. Watson do. I mean, Mr. Watson hasn't worked for, what, eight months? He's been campaigning yeah. eight months. Yeah. yeah, and he's he's uh, he, he's got full time staff. He's where do you get all that money? Yeah, he's, he's getting it from developers, and they want him in place because they know he will not be make any problems. For him. So the other hand, you are the underdog. Okay. I'm the underdog. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Well, I, I I could see. I, I checked it out before I came here. You represent uh, Capital One, right? What is the major uh, uh, project or, or bill uh, that you that you initiated and it benefited the community? Well, I, I think I've done a lot of different things. Uh, the community centers, I rebuilt all the community centers, the green community, the old fire hall, uh, the, um, the the, the uh, field houses. I put in new sewer, uh, storm sewers throughout, throughout the throughout the community. Um, I've, um, I, I put in new, new park, small park areas, um, uh, little little, uh, little um, docks on the Rio River, so you can get your canoe down and put it put it in. Uh, so lots of big things and lots of little things. Again, to bring people together to make the community like you want the river <coughs> to be able to use the river, right? Okay. You can't use it unless you have a dock. Okay. So those are kinds of things. Okay, and also Somalis, we are not only focused on Somalis because Somalis also are Muslim. Right? Mm -hmm. So nowadays, it seems that, uh, especially the United States, personally, I think it's becoming like in uh, 1930s in Germany. Wow, uh, that's pretty serious. It is sad to say because uh, I'm sure you follow, uh, you know, that lunatic who's saying that I'm going to burn down the Quran, the Holy Quran. Mm -hmm. It's like he's going get, to get, get something out of it. Well, you know, it's uh, if, yeah. If mm -hmm. you get elected, and uh, what do you think uh, the security? How you will uh, uh, protect the security of the, the Muslim mosque? Well, look, that's a sacred well, place I, I, to pray. After 9/11, mm -hmm. where did I go? Mm -hmm. I went to a mosque. Okay. That's where I went to. I went to a mosque and I worshipped with the people there. Mm -hmm. And uh, and I said to them, I said, look, you know, uh, our our tradition is politics and religion don't mix. That's we nice. separated politics from religion uh, 300 years ago. You know, and and that's the way I believe. I don't really care if you're Muslim or whatever you are. Mm -hmm. uh, you're to me, you're a citizen of our city. Absolutely. And that's it. That's all. Well, and that's what I said at that mosque. I said, you know, at the end of the day, if you think city hall isn't your city hall, if somehow you are less important if, because you're Muslim, mm -hmm. then the terrorists have won. Absolutely. They have yes. won. You've got to think that when I walk into this mosque to pray with you. I do it with the same devotion and respect as I would in any other place of worship in the city with any other group. And, that, and that's what that's what democracy without that democracy can't function. Yes. But you see it's important of course to go to the mosque and talk to the, the Muslim and give them some level of comfort. But would you do that also in Adahan, the non Muslim? to make them understand. Oh, sure. Look, Absol this is... Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you know, to me, there's no negotiation on this. Like, like Muhammad Ahmed did, a, did an interview with me for The Citizen, mm -hmm. and he I wanted to know about my religion. And we had a bit of an argument about it. I said, you know, I, I'm a Quaker by religion. You know, uh, okay. Quaker's a... Uh, very, uh, very uh, uh, peace of Yeah, we're, we're, I'm a Quaker. I said, but you know, Muhammad, I don't really think my religion has any place in this story. Because yes, when sir. when someone is, I'm asking someone to elect me. Mm -hmm. I don't. If you were running for your office, I want to know what are you going to do about public transit? Exactly. What are you going to do about the community? Absolutely. What are you going to do about jobs? I don't yes. really care what your religion Absolutely. is. Absolutely. So yes. so including it in the in the story, I didn't like. You know, I didn't. I didn't like yes. it. Yes. You see, the reason that I raised that because so now we don't only focus the Somalis, we also. Uh, uh, focus also on the Muslim community because yeah. uh, the Somalis are Muslim first. Yeah. Because you see, and it's sad because I've been in, in, in North America, United States, in here, before, at least close to 20 years. Mm -hmm. 
but this is the, the, this is what something that Listen, I have we're, we're, never yeah, we're, I have we're, never we're, seen. Listen, when the gypsies are being persecuted in France, in France, that's you, that. you know you got trouble. Exactly. That's yes. you know there's trouble. And, see, I, and, and the thing is, there's been big changes in our scene and in the last. When when I was a kid, we had no. It was it was a Catholic Protestant. The big division was Catholic Protestants. I I had one guy of color in my whole school. I think it's all, all that it comes down to economics. The reason I think uh, right. there's all this problem is because of uh, not being uh, not uh, being around a lot of jobs. Well, why do people come to Canada, right? Uh, they course. come they come for jobs. Exactly. So if you don't have jobs, so, you got so a problem. So when there is no jobs, mm -hmm. either uh, if we focus in Canada, there's, there's always some people who would like to exploit, that, take advantage, and try to turn and uh, against or divert attention to non quote unquote uh, uh, maybe Caucasian or, or, or Christian mm -hmm. and it's all it's always happening that way. But what can what would you do uh, to, to to stop that? How would you create jobs? What is your plan of creating jobs in the city? Well you create jobs in the city by making it a place that people want to be. Like like I've just explained like Creating great public transit for people that, that that create vibrant communities. Look at New York. Mm -hmm. Look at New York. Look at Vancouver. I mean, why do people want to go to these cities? They want to live in them because they're beautiful places. Mm -hmm. So my job as a, as the mayor and as a city council is to create beautiful communities that are useful to people. And then your job, or your job, and your job is to get to make jobs. And that tends to work. You look you look at job look at cities like like Philadelphia, that are falling apart. People don't want to live there anymore. And if they don't want to live there anymore, there ain't any jobs. Mm -hmm. So we've got to, my job is to create a city that people want to live into, want to move to, want to come to, and that, and, and when they come, jobs happen. I mean, look at Bank Street. It's full of jobs. Mm -hmm. It's because it's a community people want to be, live in. You look at the, some areas, you know, of, of the city that are less economically active. Mm -hmm. Why? Because they're not so attractive. Look at Preston Street. Preston Street, five, six years ago, was going down, down, down. We invested in a rebuild of the street. We look at the street now: trees, wide sidewalks, benches, pedestrian-friendly lighting, and all of a sudden, Preston's like booming. And the city didn't create any jobs there. Ordinary people created jobs, like people with cafes and, 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 and uh, so forth. But what the city did is they created an environment which people found attractive. Okay. Uh, the transit uh, uh, project, how many jobs do you think it would create and where oh, the money would come from? Uh, the jobs, I think about 7% of the city's jobs would come from that, 7-8%. So eight uh, percent, seven to eight percent. So a lot of jobs. Okay. Maybe, maybe more like ten percent. Yeah, more like ten percent. And where that money will come from? It comes from uh, federal, provincial, and, and city coffers. It's a, it's a public project. Okay. Yeah, that's where it goes. So you don't think a tunnel project would, would not bring any seven eight project? The tunnel project is a hole in the ground that just we just pour money in and we get nothing back. There's no new service, no new revenue. You get build a line down Carling Avenue. Everyone who gets on that train pops a ticket in. You get new service, new revenue, a hole in the ground, replacing buses on the surface. There's no new service, no new revenue. Nothing made. Okay. Well, the last minute, just tell them uh, uh, about last minute, for the last minute, tell them why the community should come up that day and vote for you, and also uh, tell them a little bit about yourself. I'm, I've lived in Ottawa all my life. I've always tried to be honest and square with people. Uh, I think you can trust me, uh, just like my family trusts me, because um, that's the way I am. I, um, I have no interest in being rich. I just have interest in serving the community as well as I can, and part of my community is the Somali community and they will get the same care and consideration as anybody else in our fair city. And if that's good enough for you, then vote for me, and if it isn't, 
Well, you, you, have, have, you have other candidates too, and that's democracy, and I accept that. Well, thank you. Uh, so thank much. you very much. Very much. We don't want to take your time off, but we want to take your pictures as well. Yeah. Okay. No, I'll can I can have a. Oh, you want to take it from there too? Yeah, I'll have change it here. Okay, the picture. I will take it from here. You will take it from there too. Hold on a second. Well, I changed. Uh, we're gonna send you. You give me your email. Yeah. We're gonna send you the article. Okay. And we're gonna put the YouTube as well. This one. Okay. So it's gonna be worldwide. And especially the major 